Ace money the name, getting paid by the game. My goal is to help you get that money by sharing my picks as well as some useful knowledge and betting techniques. Now, while we go over this recap, I'd like to get right into these picks so we can get in and out like a BNE with handicappers. So it's the SBR, Sportsbook Robbery. So this is our NBA, my first video. Been having a couple of issues the last couple of days trying to record. Um, I only got two plays for today, but uh, get into a couple other things. Uh, this is Action Network. I use it for lines all the time. If you guys have been watching, you know that. But as well as I started using it to track my bets again. Um, as you see, it's where I'm at right now. Taking into consideration that up until week six of NFL, my unit size was $25. And uh, week seven, uh, I mean week six, I raised it up to 35 uh, all time. You see, a little peaks and valleys, nothing crazy. But we climbing up. Uh, I did drop a couple plays, NBA, 61% hit rate for the month so far. Altogether, uh, positive in all categories so far. I did drop a few plays in the community for NBA. I haven't, this is my first video. But uh, it's the first day, started off minus 20. And then we climbed up a little bit, went crazy. Did all right yesterday. Um, yeah, I, I feel like the first day I started, uh, I did a little too much, threw in too many plays. And then the Knicks just got destroyed, so that, that killed it. There's two sites I like to use for NBA. One of them is called St uh, Lineups. Basically, you can pay for these, but I don't pay for it, so you can only use certain things. Just like action, I pay the limited, the lower amount. You know, all these sites have different levels. But uh, it shows a starting lineup and basically projected stats. Uh, and then another one I found for this outlier that I always use, they don't have preseason stats. They only keeps track during the season. So NBA.com has this site, has a bunch of different things on it. Basically, you go on it. Uh, show you how to get to the preseason results. You go to the team. You go to team stats, blah, blah, blah. Uh, what team are we working with? San Antonio Spurs. A lot of trades this year. You know, it's going to take a little bit to get used to. Click on the team. It's going to show the team stats. Go right here, switch that to players. Season type, we're going to go to preseason. Bam, and then I'll show what they've done in the preseason. All right, I do have a few play props. Let's get into that. Newly put on, uh, I guess, the rebuilt Spurs. Got a few new players. Uh, DraftKings minus 110. As you see, multiple discrepancies in books. NBA is like this. You can find good profit, good uh, EV, expected value, and discrepancies in books. That's why you got to have every type of book you can use. Uh, in the long run, it definitely helps. Uh, it's cleared this the last bunch of games. Head to head, 100%. But this is all last year. Last year, he's averaged three. But as you see, there's plenty of games he went way over, plenty of games he went under. And mind you, he's on a totally different team. The only thing I can show you is Dallas last year overall, ranked 25th. Uh, small forward position, ranked 21st. And then uh, he's in the starting lineup, so that's a good thing. This is that one site I was showing you before. We could see what he did in preseason, which you can't really go by, but it just 
gives you a little bit of an idea. Uh, rebounds are right here. And Harrison Barnes is right here. So 1.2, he's averaged these four games of preseason. Uh, five games. I don't know why that says five. Maybe it was five. Uh, 1.2 offensive, 2.2 defensive, total 3.4. So, uh, either way, two and a half, he's going to be on the court long enough. And you've seen how many rebounds he had at the end of the season last year. I mean, I know it's a different type of game, but what, uh, playoffs and, uh, you know, season opener. But what I'm noticing from the couple games I did watch to the right here is the Spurs game. Yeah, Chris Paul, too. Harrison Barnes is added on. You know, obviously, Wimbenama, whatever his name is. He's going to grab a bunch of boards, but two and a half. Uh, I just feel like it's a sweet spot. And I got it for way lower. The odds, they have changed. Maybe I didn't. They're probably back. They look to see him back. I, don't know, I dropped him in the community last night. So, uh, that's why you guys subscribe. Turn on the notifications. All right, let's get it. Harrison Barnes. Oh, what I was saying is I noticed that teams are going at it right now. You know, they everyone looks like they're taking it serious. They've been waiting to play, see what happens next week and stuff. But these game ones have been down to the wire. Some OTs. People are actually trying. You know what I mean? Two, minus 160, 215. They got on DraftKings, 145. Um, easily cleared this a bunch of times last year. He was on a new team, 65% hit rate last year. Not by much, but, you know, he's on that wing. Uh, spot up three shooter, catch and shoot three. Uh, some closeouts. I expect him to some ball movement, get that ball around. Should be able to get two assists. Uh, got Kyrie and stuff. Uh, Luca, they'd be back cutting. Kyrie is a good back cutter. Um, Clay Thomas, right down here. Averaging two assists per game in the um, preseason. Starting lineup here, we got Luca Irving, Clay starting, PJ, Washington, Gafford. So, uh, new and improved lineup. Um, yeah, so let's get it. Clay Thompson. This play is for you. If you could hit that like button, new viewers, subscribe. Let's turn on the notifications so you get all my plays, my live bets, anything I do, I try to give it to you guys, I try to be as transparent as possible. Uh, not only do I give you my picks, and every pick I give you, I bet. I'm not, I'm not a YouTuber. I just started this. I am a sports better. Um, I won't give you anything I don't put money on. My performance in the last month, started using this bet tracker about a month ago, September 22nd. A little over a month. Uh, there was a little gap. Uh, but yeah, we had 61% hit rate, 94 and 59. That's all sports. So uh, if you could leave a comment too, likes and comments, help get the videos out there. As well as uh, I don't get paid for this. So uh, it's just interaction. It makes it feel worth it to me. You know what I mean? Like I'm not doing this for nothing. People are using it. But uh, let's get it. It's not only giving you my picks. I'm giving you tips and techniques and just ways to commit that sportsbook robbery. So let's get it. East money to name, getting paid for the game. Let's go. Okay.